So here's the allotment as of early August. You'll see it's changed quite a lot since we last posted a video. The grass paths separating the plots have become well established. We've got some nice looking peppers here. Lettuces nearly ready to pick. Some pumpkins here. More pumpkins or courgettes there. And Swiss chard, which we planted a few weeks ago coming up. More Swiss chard. Lots of yellow courgettes down here. Yin yang beans, runner beans, various brassica type crops underneath here. Um, I'll have another go at these cages next year. I'm going to make them a bit differently, but they've kept the pigeons off quite well. So yeah, various sort of curly kale, purple sprouting broccoli and Cavallo Nero. We have got some potatoes in up here. Um, from memory, I think it's about 20 different potato plants, four different varieties. Uh, we have some leeks. Only the last few days we've seeded these paths, so we're expecting some rain over the next few days, which would help them along. It's been a very hot, sunny, dry summer. We've, we've, had, we've had to bring water up almost every day just to irrigate some of our new plants. Um, so the weather's been lovely, things have grown well. Um, but yeah, uh, there's been a big water shortage. Only in the past few days I've put in some spring onions and some spinach beet and some beetroot. Literally just uh, seeds in the ground just to see what comes up. I've got nothing to lose at this point. We've got more black currants and red currants than we know what to do with. We've, we're giving them away. We're just inviting plot holders to come in and get them. We put a little plastic greenhouse here, which has got some tomato plants in at the moment. And just this morning, I planted some mint plants and some rosemary. Uh, they were for sale at a reduced price at Asda, uh, intended, of course, as food rather than as a gardening crop. But for 25 pence a plant, I couldn't say no. And so here we are. This is the Robinson plot as of now. Um, we're going to still going to re-roof the shed. Um, I'll do that when I've got the time. You'll see I've also got some more butts there and we're going to uh, plumb them into the guttering to get an irrigation system sorted out. I picked some runner beans this morning, picked some courgettes this morning as well. It was hard going with the ground. Um, it's very fertile soil, but gets baked absolutely rock hard. Um, and I had to chip away at it with a fork. Um, eventually someone lent us a rotivator, uh, which made it much easier. I could just get over and rotivate the whole plot. Um, needed, had to be done. Um, and and now it's looking good.